big water, big walleyes, and they tend to be aggressive. We've discovered new tactics for dealing with these fish. Good. Got Dead one, stick. Jeff? Dead stick, yeah. Got one? Yeah. Excellent. That didn't take long. No. No, that's okay, right. you want me to grab that other rod? I got it, yeah. All right. I think he did come in on that when I was jigging there, and then he come over and smack this, uh, it's decent, smack that dead stick, you know? That's the cool thing about this system, isn't it, Gordon? Is it ever? One, one kind of attracts, and you know, Doug's talked so much about attracting and triggering, and this is the ultimate setup, an attractor rod and a triggering rod, and sometimes they'll hit this, and sometimes they'll yeah. move over for the dead stick. Ooh, ooh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Those Waldos this time of year, okay? <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. lovely Jeff. Nice. Good way to start, eh? Ooh, nice, Jeff. Beautiful <laughs> start. Cool. Hey, that's your fish. You hold it. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, that's, that's what... Beautiful fish. Greenbacks. Like, yeah. As you can tell from the clay, they get that very distinctive green on their backs. Yeah. Aren't they beautiful? They are. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Yeah, no, they came in and then just smacked that, smacked that dead stick. You know, we had these these rod holders and they, he's positioned it right over that hole. Exactly. With that light action tip and boy, that's just a deadly system. It has been for years. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. Cool. Let's get this on hook. And what were you jigging the other rod with? Well, I got the, the, those horizontal baits, uh, which uh, represent that the forage minnow so well. But yes. the, these. Uh, it had the the rattle and the sound, as you know, and the vibration. You know, the the those all those factors in this dirtier water. Uh, see, it really seemed to bring those fish in, huh? Absolutely, absolutely. Yep. You know, many days uh, when you're jigging the rattling baits and the vibrating baits, I would say 20 to 40 percent of the time they come roaring in and they smack it. But it's almost like they come in and they they see that active aggressive bait and they look over and there's a dead stick minnow hanging there and they just it's like there's a T-bone steak and it's way easier. <laughs> Isn't that right? Yeah. Right, great. Neat. Beautiful. Let's get her back, Gord. Beautiful fish. Well, my turn. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> you know, the system is really, really sweet. Now, we call these, you know, your classic dead stick, which is, you see that real light action tip, almost like a summer rod. Uh, but it quickly, you know, gains and stiffens up about halfway down here. And you can see when that fish bit, boy, that really serves as a strike indicator to me. And also the fish can't can't feel that resistance. So it gives you just enough time to reach over and set the hook. Now, it's real simple. You know, you just need some some bait. Uh, here we're using, uh, you know, salted salted chiners here, but you know, a, a live minnow or a dead minnow, whatever, whatever it is, it's a matter of, you know, you're jigging with this one and attracting the fish in. And if they don't go for that, oftentimes they will go for the little more subtle uh, presentation. So, uh, real simple, just hook it up, wrap it down, and then goes right in this sweet otter rod holder, which is completely adjustable. It's got this, this nice arm, you know, that you can adjust here, the tension. So I can position that right, so it's easy for me to grab. You know, and even when I when I move or something, it'll jiggle that rod, you know, which isn't a problem. Um, actually adds a little action to that, that bait. So it's a pretty sweet setup. And I'm gonna grab my, my jigging rod. And so now we have a, a real dual a dual system. And what's nice about this, this little orange, uh, and, and like some dead sticks have uh, orange back to here. Uh, Frayball just has a little bead on there, which is just enough that if any movement, uh, my peripheral, I can, I can see that no problem and get on that fish pretty quick. 